Hello Crankers! Let me give you a short introduction to what is a hurdy-gurdy and how does it work. The history of the hurdy-gurdy goes back to the Middle Ages. The first pictorial representations of a medieval form of a hurdy-gurdy come from the 12th century and show a so-called organistrum, which had a large body and had to be played by two persons at the same time. The organistrum even appears in texts from the 10th century. In countries such as France, Hungary and many other European countries, the hurdy-gurdy has been part of the traditional music for decades to centuries and has recently received more and more attention worldwide, which is great. <laughs> First of all, the hurdy-gurdy is a stringed instrument. Stringed instruments typically need a bow to cause vibration to the strings and produce sounds. We all know this from violins, cellos and also the nickel harper for example. But the hurdy-gurdy is a special case. Instead of a bow, the hurdy-gurdy has a wheel that is made of wood or a special plastic. The strings you want to play are placed on the wheel. Then you have to get the wheel moving by turning the crank. You can even put a single string on the wheel or several strings at the same time. Strings that shouldn't have any contact with the wheel are placed on little tail pieces. A certain amount of dry or liquid rosin is applied to the wheel to get the so-called stick-slip effect between the wheel and the string and for getting the sound stronger and louder. Strings are always covered with a thin layer of cotton so that the tone sounds softer and the wheel, depending on the material it is made of, is not damaged. If you want me to make a video about how to apply cotton on the strings, then just write it in the comments below. But how do I create a melody? The hurdy-gurdy is not only similar to the violin and other stringed instruments, but also to the piano. And now you'll see why. To shorten the strings and change the pitch, the hurdy-gurdy has keys. Small rods, which are called tangents, are attached to them, which, when you press the keys, are pressed against the string and shorten the string at this point. The tangents are held in place by a small screw that can be loosened to fine-tune the tangents. As with most other stringed instruments, there are tuning packs for all strings. The hurdy-gurdy is fully chromatic, that means a range of two octaves is available. The gurdy is not only a stringed instrument, but also a so-called drone instrument like bagpipes or the nickel harfa. That means in addition to the melody being played, the hurdy-gurdy can also create a constant tone, which is usually the keynote and which is used as the bass. The hurdy-gurdy has drone strings that can simply be placed on the wheel and produce one and the same tone as soon as the wheel is turned. And now let's talk about something that makes the hurdy-gurdy even more special. The special thing about the hurdy-gurdy, which sets it apart from other stringed and drone instruments is that it has so-called trumpet strings and that means the hurdy-gurdy can create a buzzing sound. Like the drone strings, they are usually tuned to a tone that is not changed while playing. The gurdy player produces the typical buzzing sound through a special hand technique while turning the crank. The buzzing is also created by these small pieces of wood, also called dog or chien, moving up and down and vibrating on a small plate when an impulse is given. 
And this is how you can create the magical and unique sound of the trumpet strings. The intensity of the buzzing sound can be adjusted using extra pegs. As you can see, the hurdy gurdy is very versatile. You can play a bass line, a melody, and also play rhythm to it. And of course, you can also choose different combinations of the strings you want to play. If you want to know more about the Hurdy Gurdy and if you have a special question then just write it in the comments and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and to subscribe to my channel. If you want to learn more about the features of my Hurdy Gurdy then just click this video here and if you want to see me play then just click on this playlist. Thank you for watching!